And a good Sunday morning, it's October 2nd. Yes, it's the first week of October. And yes, it's usually our transitional period after a very warm, humid September. October looks to be a little bit cooler and drier, you know, and we got the marine layer back. It's gonna be in the mid to upper 70s today, which is nice. It was 77 yesterday. And yes, it's been getting cooler. It feels great, actually. Um, yeah, so the Dodgers, after winning their 110th game last night, they go for enough. They they go for lucky 111 to tie the 1954 Indians. The Angels look to sweep the Texas Rangers to complete the homestand. And yes, they officially clinched third place in the AL West. And I think they will avoid 90 losses if they can win the last four games of the season. But yes, it was a disappointing year for the Halos in Orange County, but the Dodgers, we're just getting the party started, you know, trying to make another run at the World Series championship. And uh, Sunday night baseball, you got the Braves and the, and the Mets. And yes, the Braves moved ahead of the Mets by a game, and boy, if the Braves sweep the Mets, um, that means the Braves have won the season series 10 games to nine. But yes, this is the tiebreaker right here. And I think whoever wins the season series, if they finish tied, one of the teams will win the division, the other will be the first wild card. But at least it's the best two out of three. And um, yes, we have a lot of football this Sunday. Yeah, Sundays are known for football. Yeah, the Rams and Niners play tomorrow. Today we got the Chargers at the Texans. Raiders play the Broncos. Um, the Sunday night game is Tampa Bay against uh, Kansas City, a rematch of the of the Super Bowl uh, Super Bowl Fifty Five, a rematch of Super Bowl Fifty Five. And then the Packers play the Patriots today. And also um, the Titans play the Colts. Um, yeah, the Steelers play the Jets. And the Eagles play the Jaguars. Um, And also, um, yeah, well, got a lot of birthdays today. A happy, oh yes, a happy heavenly birthday to Maury Wills who would have turned 90 today. Yeah. Yeah, Maury Wills would have turned 90. And also a happy birthday to Freddie Jackson and to Sting from the police. Also happy birthdays to Scott Schoenweiss and Eddie Guardado, the former closer. Also a happy birthday to Lance McCullers Jr. and to Cam Bedrosian. And of course a happy heavenly birthday to Gerald, Gerald Oshida. And also um, a happy birthday to Jackie Autry, the, the widow of Jean Autry. Yeah, so, yeah, I can't believe the regular season's winding down almost. And, man, I wouldn't be surprised if the Braves won the division for the fifth consecutive year. And also, only four more games for the legendary Albert Pujols. 701 homers, but we'll see if he can at least hit maybe one or two more before he finally hangs it up for good, but he's a first ballot Hall of Famer. And um, yeah. And the Potters are very close to clinching a playoff spot and so are the Phillies. The Brewers are fall falling off the wagon, it looks like. The American League's all set. Right now, the Blue Jays are the first American League wildcard team. And 
Yeah, well, only the NL East has yet to be determined. Um, yes, this, is, this has been a great year. Albert Pujols, 700 home runs. Miguel Cabrera with 3,000 career hits. And Aaron Judge tying Roger Maris. And he also has four more games to try to break Roger Maris's American League home run record. Um, meanwhile, have a good rest of your Sunday and uh, go Dodgers. Amen.